Okay, so say you want to sample some lake water. You're in a boat, you're sitting on a lake, but you don't want to sample the top of the lake. You want to sample, say like, I don't know, 20 meters down, and you want the water that's 20 meters down. You would use something called a Van Dorn bottle. And a Van Dorn bottle looks a little bit like this. It's a bottle that has stoppers, rubber stoppers on both ends, and you can open both ends at the same time. It's, this is a real, um, <laughs> it's a little finicky. It's not working for me very well, but what you really wanna do is open both ends of the bottle like this, and then you can see that I could lower this down in the water column. Okay, so I'm lowering it down in the water column. And the mechanism, the way it's supposed to work, is you put these two little loops through this little pin here, and it holds it, holds it open. So we're just gonna pretend, because the mechanism isn't working, that I'm holding it open as I'm lowering it down. And technically, there are some bottles that lower down like this, kind of horizontal. This bottle, this mechanism is supposed to lower it down like this. So the rope comes off the top like this. And so it's lowering, lowering, lowering down to the place where you want to collect. And then if the mechanism were working correctly, what you can see here is this little pin that goes down. I would put the, these pieces in and then let go and now the pin, when it lets go, is going to let that fly. So I think I think one might work. This other one was too tight. I'm going to hold on to it. So what happens is you lower it down on the rope, and you have this thing, which is called a messenger. And I love that name, messenger, because you're like sending a message to the bottle. But the message is basically just this heavy uh, weight that slides down the rope. And so it slides down the rope. So basically, what would happen normally is, I wouldn't be holding all this, it would be below me in the water. I would have the rope going up to the boat and I would send the messenger down and it would close the bottle and it would close the bottom too. And now, once the messenger has set off the latch mechanism, I've got a sealed water sample from 20 meters below in the lake and I could pull it up and then I could dispense that water into my sample bottles. Um, and so that's really cool because it allows us to, to catch water at different layers in the lake and to find things like the, the chemocline um, or to find bacteria that might be living along the thermocline in a lake. So that's a Van Dorn bottle for you.